Well, hey, ABC 57 is giving back this holiday season, and we want you to know you can too. Yeah, all week long you've seen our anchor team out showcasing Michigan nonprofit holiday heroes dedicated to helping others at Christmas and all year round. Well, tonight, ABC 57 morning anchor Summer Horan is up late live at the Ronald <laughs> McDonald House in downtown South Bend with how you can help too. Summer? Brian and Jennifer, during the holidays, I know we are all full steam ahead. We're planning the meals, the parties, and the gifts. But this year, I want to help us all slow down a little bit and take that time to realize that, hey, we can give back. I wanted to show you what volunteering looks like here at Ronald McDonald House Charities of Michiana from my experience just last week. Take a look. We have a very simple mission. We take care of families of sick and injured children ages 21 and younger. For 21 years, Ronald McDonald House has given everything to families in their darkest times. You never know when an accident's gonna happen. Um, you know, illness and injury doesn't discriminate. It can happen all hours of the night. It can happen on any holidays. Serving up to 20 overnight families at a time and thousands of daily guests, Ronald McDonald House is a 24-7 operation that needs volunteers now more than ever. These six months are usually tougher for us because we're looking for more volunteers for to help us, and um, especially weekends. Um, we're really low on the weekends. So what are your volunteering options? We accept volunteers that are interested in organizing, cleaning, cooking, baking, um, really whatever you're into as a person, we'll try to find a good fit for. And I started the day with volunteer services coordinator, Maddie Reese. You have been with Ronald McDonald House Charities now for a year and a half, and you help newbies like me get acquainted with lunches with love. So first, what is that and what does it do for people here? Yeah, our lunches with love program is a to-go meal program where we box up lunches and send them over to the hematology oncology department at the hospital. So we are gonna fill these boxes with these pies. So we've got apple pie here. So if you wanna start with that, and then I can start with this pecan pie. And they're both from Rise and Roll, which is amazing. And they're kind of like a little community partner in a way too. Yes, yep. So Rise and Roll actually works with um, another one of our community partners, which is Cultivate. Um, they provide dinner for us every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, which is amazing. After the meals are prepped and packed, they're loaded into the cart and brought to the hematology and oncology floor at Beacon Children's Hospital. When we saw our numbers increase during the pandemic, we realized that we need to be taking our lunges to them so that they don't have to come over uh, to the house and take that time away from their child. have lunches for you yeah. and some dessert I can trade you oh there you go <laughs> you make an ice cream I got perfect I'm gonna have to give this back to you so you can keep playing and enjoying okay <laughs> well thank you for sharing enjoy your meal say bye bye, -bye. Bringing a sense of home to families and the RMHC team. You go home every day knowing that you did something good. Yeah. And even if it was on their worst day, you helped them get through it. Now, Michiana, you can probably tell my cheeks are a little flushed. I just get so excited thinking about my time here, spent volunteering, and I can't wait to come back again because I had so much fun with Christ or excuse me, Kirsten Eifler and her full team. Thank yes. you for having me back again. Of course, anytime, anytime. So this is a typical Friday evening. It's around 6 o'clock. What are we gearing up for right now? So dinner. So we serve a, a hot uh, meal at 6 p.m. Um, Sunday through Saturday, 365 days a year. So, um, yeah, every uh, family can expect that. And we also serve lunch at noon every day as well. So. And right here behind you, can we actually see Helen? Hi, Helen. Hey. Uh, she's helping us get that food prepared right now. We've got some rise and roll biscuits and other things coming out of the oven. It smells amazing. And this is all going back to those families who are taking care of their kids at Beacon Children's Hospital. Yes, yep. Any family that has a hospitalized child is welcome to use our services. And I was just tickled to be able to come and highlight you guys this week. You guys do so much good for the community year round, week by week. And if anybody at Michiana is feeling inspired and saying, hey, I kind of want to do what Summer's doing. She's having some fun and just getting to know so many people in Michiana. 
how can they become a part? They can visit our website at rmhcmichiana.org, uh, or they're welcome to give us a call at 574-647-3020, um, and they can uh, get a hold of us either way, and uh, we'll get them signed up to be a volunteer and, and all the things that come with that. Well, I wish my brain was as good as yours. That was very good with the phone number. Oh. But hey, Michiana, we're going to have all of that information for you too on our website, abc57.com. Head to the Holiday Heroes tab and you'll find our story and be able to come a volunteer here at Ronald McDonald House Charities of Michiana. Kirsten, it was so good to see you. Thank I you know. for spending the evening with me. You too, Summer. <laughs> Thanks for being here. We appreciate it. And Michiana, I had so much fun with you this evening, but for now, I need some sleep as your morning anchor, so I'm going to send things back to everybody in the studio.